Hey Jay, this is Mike from Dave Wright Subaru. I'm sending you this awesome video with me with my awesome beer that you like so much because I want to tell you about EyeSight. I know you don't want it and I don't want to get you one if you don't want it, but uh, in your text you said, uh, I don't want the lane departure, I can see it, I get that, but there is uh, actually four things that EyeSight gives you and I want you to know what they are before you say you don't want it. I can, again, I can get you one without it for two grand less. We have a whole bunch of them on the lot that have it that I could, you know, Put you in right now uh, otherwise we would have to go to another dealer to get one without it but basically eyesight consists of three things lane departure like you said it warns you if your car is drifting over the lanes it'll beep and it'll actually can even pull you back a little if you want it to if you don't want it to pull you back there, there's a button you can push to disengage that so it just beeps second one is pre-collision braking if uh, you're driving and you're looking at the pheasant off the side of the road or you're talking to helen and you didn't realize the car in front of you stopped abruptly and you're not, you're gonna hit him, it will stop before you hit that car. That's called pre-collision braking. So lane departure, pre-collision braking, and then adaptive cruise is totally awesome. If you are out on the highway with your cruise set, and you're going, say you have your cruise set at 70, and you come up on a car that's going any speed lower than 70, it will slow down to their speed and adjust and stay about 100 feet away from them without having to hit adjust or you know cruise or, or uh, resume or coast or any of that. It just ad adapts to their speed. So that's the adaptive cruise. And then the reverse automatic braking is if, if uh, Helen is backing up and she's gonna hit something, it will actually uh, stop her from hitting something. So I can get you one without the eyesight, totally doable, but uh, we don't have any on the lot. My question to you is, is if we give you a good enough deal on one that has it maybe, uh, you're willing to take it with, with the eyesight if you see any value in it. But it's definitely good stuff. They're starting to make it standard on almost all the on the, all the Subarus pretty soon because it's proven to be so uh, helpful to people. So again, you have a lane departure, pre-collision braking, um, adaptive cruise, and reverse automatic braking. So really good stuff. Again, I don't want to try to put you in something you don't want, but I wanted you to know what it all consists of because uh, I think you were just thinking that it was just the lane departure. So there's a lot more to it and it's really good technology. So let me know what you think of that uh, and I'll, I'll go from there. All right.